Hi everyone, this is going to be quite a quick video showing you how to fit sound into the new Haldron Class 57. It's not going to be the longest video that I've ever done or the highest quality, but a lot of people have asked so I just wanted to make sure that I'd done something. Uh, I have been quite busy recently so I haven't done as many videos as I usually would, um, but hopefully people find this one interesting anyway. So. I've already loosened the body and taken it off on this so I could have a look and it's quite a tight fit so I, uh, I haven't put it all the way back on yet but it's basically just clipped on so you've got clips here and here at each side so you just want something like this prizing tool or maybe some guitar picks something that's quite thin um, and you can use those to get the um, the body off. I've got quite a few different types of pressing tool on the website, so have a look and uh, everybody's got their own preference of which one that they like to use. Once you've got the body off, you'll see that there's a 21 pin socket. So I'm going to just take the uh, blanking plug off. So I'll just move that out of the way so you can see your socket there. Um, you'll also see that there's some wires. Um, I don't know how well you can make it out on the video, but there's some wires that are just um, heat shrinked and sort of insulated at the end. But those are actually your speaker wires. So you can cut this off and uh, expose some of that wire and you can actually solder your speakers onto there if you want. Otherwise, if you're buying a decoder from me, you might find, well, you might have selected to have the speaker already fitted, in which case you can just unplug this and uh, just carefully take the little socket out and you don't need that part on at all anymore. Um, in terms of speakers, I wasn't sure where it was going to be, um, but I've decided that the best thing is going to be to use these um, 25 by 25 megabase speakers because if you look at each end of the model, there's a nice space. Um, you could just use one of these, by the way. You don't actually have to use two, but I think two will just give a slightly sort of bigger sound. But most people will probably be happy with one. Um, bear in mind that these are four ohm speakers, so if you are using two of them, you need to be wiring them in series, not parallel. So there's details about that on the website, but obviously get in touch with me or leave a comment or whatever if you're not sure. But yeah, I'm just going to solder these onto the wire plug in series, obviously. And then I'm going to put my decoder on there. And then I'll just make sure that these are held down with black tack. And that's basically going to be it. And then the body will go back on over the top. So that's all I'm going to show you in this video. Hopefully it's something that you can take on yourself at home. Obviously I can fit them for you too if you need help with it. But yeah, leave a comment if you've got any questions. And obviously get in touch through the website or through my Facebook page and stuff if you uh, do want to get in contact. Thank you for watching.